open for business and already taking a bite out of a big problem at Hampton Roads. Yeah, we've reported on the many construction delays for the Peninsula Regional Animal Shelter over the past year, but it's far from an empty project site anymore. Since last May, I've been checking on their progress, visiting the site off Jefferson Avenue in Newport News, inquiring about the Peninsula Regional Animal Shelter's plans. Voila, here's the finished product. A state-of-the-art facility by all means, and with less than a month under their belt, they have plenty of four-legged friends on hand. What you doing? I see you. I see you. We come and say, oh, you're visiting. Roger Isles took us on an exclusive tour of a place you might want to visit sometime soon. The cats and kittens, the dogs of all sizes, some that I even had a hard time wanting to part. Everything's been thought of from the time the animals arrive. Because we don't know a lot about these animals, we want to start from day one, and this becomes day one for us. Mm -hmm. We want to weigh the animal and make sure that we know it's healthy. From strays to the transition rooms, the staff here is hoping to adopt out as many animals as they can, walking them, working on social skills so they're ready for a home and more. We feed a Nutramax. Mm -hmm. It's a um, natural ingredient based food. There's another room for cleaning. Well, this is the nuts and bolts of the facility. Welcome to our world. And there's a trained professional right around the corner who showed us the modern technology they have to spot medical problems fast. And what we note here is um, the large size of the heart. The trachea actually extends upwards. It's a reality check. Excitement aside, this facility was built because the Peninsula SPCA no longer wants to handle one heartbreaking task of ending a precious life. But aside from when medically necessary, the Peninsula Regional Animal Shelter wants to make sure as many animals leave here as family pets as possible for years to come. Now there's a lot still underway. The building will be dedicated next week on the 27th. They're accepting strays now from animal control, but it'll be another month before they're ready to adopt. And the big grand opening will be in the spring. I'll keep you up to date. I'm putting more information on job opportunities and how you can help the Peninsula Regional Animal Shelter on wavy.com.